Can you give us any assurance that if you become elected, Nikki Smith won't take over the mayor office? No, I am saying that Nikki Smith no longer exists. As a psychology major, I've studied multiple personality syndromes. Yeah, well, maybe you should have studied some manners. As painful as the subject may be, we all have the right to be concerned. Fine. Then let me calm your fears. Yes, it's true. My mother suffered from a dual personality, and it was difficult for her and for our family. But not only was she able to conquer those episodes, but the doctors have assured us that she is never going to suffer from that again. Nikki Smith will never, never surface again. Obviously, otherwise she would not be running for election. One thing my mother does understand is the challenge of adversity. And my mother is a winner. And I am telling you that if she is capable of dealing with Nikki Smith and defeating her, then she is capable of confronting every problem in this town and solving it. Now, my mother wrote several articles for the banner explaining this horrible ordeal that she went through. Nikki Smith has is, is been commonly acknowledged. Everyone knows about her. I suggest you read those articles. It might teach you a little something that you haven't learned in your psychology books. Namely, that the power of the human spirit not only endures, but prevails. Thank you, Ms. Thank you, Ms. Gordon. Our uh, time is up. On behalf of the Landview University Student Council, I would like to extend my thanks and appreciation to our candidates for sharing their views with us. I, uh, I don't know what to think, but you can. Uh, I apologize for the embarrassing question. Thank you, but it was hardly your fault. You know, when you become a public figure, unfortunately, your life becomes public as well. Well, it doesn't excuse bad manners. I'm really sorry. Thank you. Victoria. I feel terrible about what that young man did to you. Are you okay? Do you know something, Roger? That thought never crossed my mind. Although I'm quite sure that if Herb ever needed a juicy bit of scandal, you could provide it for him, couldn't you? You know I don't play those games. I didn't think you did, but then I never thought you would betray me either. So quite frankly, I don't know what you are capable of. But Victoria, about what happened between us. What happened between us is over. Now you go your way and I go mine. Did you plant that student in the audience? Oh, for crying out loud. I want to win this election, Roger, but I'm not going to destroy Vicky to do it. Oh, don't look at me. I thought it was reprehensible. I actually felt sorry for Vicky. Well, I did. I am beginning to wonder if the right member of this family is running for mayor. <laughs> Your speech was brilliant. Thank you very much for standing hey. up for me. What are daughters for? Come on, let's get out of here. Uh, Megan, may I talk with you? With you.